So from women's doubles, back to men's doubles. And Oliver Rott and Michael Fuchs of Germany up against Rupesh Kumar and Sanave Thomas from India. Germans, yellow shirts. Veteran players, really, from India. Rupesh Kumar is about to turn 32 at the end of this month. His partner, Samuel Thomas, 31. And Oliver Rupesh Kumar. Yes, and this is a men's doubles combination from India that have been playing together for many years on the World Tour. Eighth year together. It was teamed up in 2004. Oh, know each other's games inside out, which is why they made such a good and formidable men's doubles combination. Left side. So this first round men's doubles encounter. Oliver Orot on the left as we look at them. Michael Fuchs is the older of the two men, 29 years of age, his partner 25. But it's Oliver Roth, who is the taller of the two men. World ranking at 29. They've played 18 tournaments to get that world ranking. And only formed their partnership following the World Championships in Paris. Because all the, day, all the uh, German pairings were swapping around due to number of players in retirement following that event. Christoph Hopp for one. Spitko, I think he retired from the international scene as well. And of course, playing with Michael Fuchs, Roman Spitko reached number 14 in the world. So we know that Michael Fuchs is a very good men's doubles player. He's doing very, very well in the mixed doubles as well at the moment. Semi-finalists at the All England Championships, if my memory serves me right. So to the Indian pair of Rupesh Kumar. He's on the right as we look at them. Sanabe Thomas. As I say, both in their 30s, both 31 at the moment, but Rupesh Kumar to turn 32 on the 31st of August. Up one place in the world ranking this week from 35 to 34. But it's worrying their win-loss record for 2011. Four and eight, negative. They did reach the quarter-finals of the Swiss Grand Prix. They only played six individual tournaments this year. The other two losses, I have to explain, come from the Sudaman Cup in Qingdao. Because the Sudaman Cup team competition counts towards world rankings. So, uh, umpire from Poland, service judge from Denmark, and all the court officials always, for all of these matches, are neutral. They never have umpire and service judges from the same nation of any of the players on court, and that takes some organising as well. So as far as the Indian pair are concerned, not only eighth year playing to together in the men's doubles partnership, seven career titles, the last of them last year when they won the Bahrain International, reached the final of the Indian Grand Prix gold event last year as well, which has since been promoted to a super series event. Oh. 
Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Sanav Thomas, Rupesh Kumar, India. On my left, Michael Fuchs, Oliver Roth, Germany. Sanav Thomas to serve to Oliver Roth, Lavo, Lake. So the Indian pair. Far side of the court as we look down. Lower rank of the two pairs at 34. Germans at 29. But Morton, this is the only match I've called today where the opponents have played each other once previously. Or yeah. any times previously. Yes. Yep. And that was in the first round of the Swiss Grand Prix earlier this year, and obviously with the Indian pair going on to reach the quarterfinal, they won that first round encounter, two straight games, 21-19, 21-16. So it'll be interesting to see whether the Germans have learnt from that defeat, whether they use different tactics. Were you at the Swiss Open this year? No, I, I did not attend, and, and it's, it's funny you say that, because uh, obviously One, I've been looking at it as well, and. And, and to me, somehow the German pair is, is, is a bit favourite to win. I know they have a little bit higher ranking, but that's normally, you know, that could be anything. But, uh, but I, I just think that uh, the Germans are more that's aggressive right. and powerful and, and so on. The, the, the Indian pair is stylish, and, but I should say they are both in their 30s now, and uh, you know, age is... Uh, Sort of showing a, a little bit of sign there. Yes, because I always remember son of A. Thomas in years gone by. There he is. He uh, was never a, averse to throwing himself around the court. Big dives in an effort to retrieve the shuttle. Not able to do that quite as freely as he used to be able to. And I wonder how much desire they've got left this pair from India you know there's there's of course there's a real desire to win every match you play and, and there's a real desire for them to go to the Olympics come to the Olympics I should say in a year's time here in this very arena good rally but as you and I know, it's not just about the major events. If we could all just turn up at World Championships and Olympic <laughs> Games, and of course we'd be inspired the whole time, but it's yeah. day in, day out, that training, work, yeah. uh, the intensity of the training, pushing yourself to the absolute limit. And there is a stage where, I know it happened to me, you just get tired of it. Yes, uh, absolutely, and I, I think you're right in what you're saying. You're not, uh, you know, being negative about anything is just Seven, fact of life yeah and 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 that's how it is and and it's it's exactly the same way i view the indian pair have they have they really got the desire yeah precisely that's the question mark in my own mind service over two seven German pair so far have really emphasised your point, the fact that they're more aggressive, they're more proactive in court, they, yeah. they're showing they want it. Yeah, and they've got a, a, a bit more power as well, they can finish uh, the rallies as well, the German pair. Strings gone in his racket there, yeah. yeah. Maybe Once think again. The, the frame broke. Yeah. Yeah. So always makes a funny sound, doesn't it? 
long strings go or racket breaks. Game interval. 11 4 in the ball. German pair with a second point advantage. Yes, another Danish coach, Jakob Hoy. There's the Danish coach for the Australian pair as well. Yeah, she says speaking German. Yes. I think it's quite good to in German. But actually, it's, uh, I mean, you've alluded to a, a very important thing because the, the Danish system for training coaches and really developing coaches, I think, is absolutely outstanding. I mean, they've, they've got coaches based all over the world and they've all come through the development coaching scheme. Yeah, every, everyone is uh, sort of... Uh, going through the system, apart from a very few, including myself. But uh, yes, uh, the system is really good and, and they get a, a very broad education and then they seem to be very successful wherever they go. I think you're excused having been world number one for <laughs> such a long period of time to go through all your coaching awards. Yes, I, I don't have any. I don't have any. I do, I do apologise for that. So, but I've been around for a few years. Called for Michael Fuchs, immediately apologises. Yes, graduate in sports science is Michael Fuchs, but now studying to become an English and PE teacher. And he just like to practice his English. Comes and yeah. talks to me often, and his charming young man. Six straight points. Nine four to fifteen four, but that run is finally broken. One. Yeah, that's good. A solid attack from the engine pair. They kept it all the way, and that's what they have to do. This is really what they have to do. Six fifteen. aggression on the return of serve. Service over, six and six. Yeah. I also think uh, the German pair benefits from the fact that they have another German pair, Ingo Kinderfater and I can't remember his partner's name. Schuttler. That's, Johannes. That's correct. Schuttler. And they did Service really over, well in um, Singapore. Singapore. Yeah and got to the semis or something like that. That's right. So they've got two good pairs. They sort of can practice uh, 
uh, on a daily day basis where I think the Indian pair is obviously uh, the only one pair they have in, in India at the moment and have for, for quite some time in, in the doubles. It's over 17-7. because of course badminton is a sport where you're absolutely reliant on having sparring partners to practice against well, once again the luck of the net ball for Fuchs Maybe he need to save them. Who knows? Don't spend them all at once. Service <laughs> <laughs> so over eight eighteen. Oh, it's all very fast and furious. Yeah, crisscross. Time is over, 20 game point nine. But the Germans are quite sure to get a game this time. A very impressive important performance in that opening game from First Rott game won and by Fuchs. Michael Fuchs well, that's Rott. the funny thing, that's that's how I pictured it from the beginning. This is how I pictured this this match. Uh, but um, obviously all credit to the Indian pair, they, they managed to win last time they met. So the question is, Morton, what have the Indian pair got to, to do? They've obviously got to change something. Yes. What should they be focusing on? I think they have to tease, cheat their opponents a bit. I, if if I, I was there, I were them, I would uh, slow it down. Um, play really soft shots on your return and all these things, just soft shots. Yeah. And uh, just make sure that when you get the attack, you keep it down with a steep anchor. If you hit hard, you tend to play flatter. And when they play flatter, they get counter attacks. So they play soft shots and into what we call these mid court areas. And then when they get the lift, make sure it's steep, steep enough. Yeah. Second game, level, late. <laughs> It was a very fast and furious opening well, rally and, and not doing what you suggested. There was the I'm power play from I'm the back. I'm not saying that's <laughs> the complete key to it, but uh, yet, yet again, it was a point proven anyway. Yes. Oh. 
is over. One all. Oh, good serve. Yeah, perfect. Ready to go, come on. Three, one. Over, two, three. Again, yeah, I think it was actually um, a good choice lifting it over his opponent. It was going too far, I can see that, but I think they had a good counter-attacking chance on the next one if, uh, if it had been in. Service over, four, two. Serve this time from five two. Lupesh Kumar. Again, I think it's well spotted by the injured pair because uh, Rout is, is is really moving too fast. He's he's very quick on that short attack. Over, three, oh, five. Flicking a little too often. But yet again, uh, even Fuchs is uh, when he's attacking, he's, he's quite flat. You can see he was almost into his racket yeah. where the counter-attacking ch chance was. So when they flick these services, uh, the the answer is, is quite flat where they can go in and counter-attack. So I still think it's a it's, it's a good choice. So it's over, 6-3. Oh, so it's over, 4-6. Two, That's where I think Thomas should have Five, six. tried to play a soft one. He had yeah. three chances and all three he really tried to whack it back. Take it pace, take the pace out of it. Yeah, there's the block to the net. Exactly, and, and the lift Eight, over them five. and all that, not going into these flat exchanges and, and then going counter attack, soft one there. Well played. The situation from the son of eight Thomas. Nine five. There's the angled smash that you were talking about in between the first and second game, rather than going for power, going for angle and placement. 
much better as a pair aren't they that they're, they're setting Ten up five. the rally for each other mm. getting the other player involved it's, it's much better here in the second set than in the first much better and that's reflected in the scoreline five point advantage so it's over so five point advantage at the mid game interval. to the open game. Yeah. It's completely changed around. Mm. He's on the same wavelength as you, Bob. Well, let go of the chance saying the block and move forward. If the Germans understand that change of tactics, they have to move forward as well. Yeah. So they're not getting caught by the soft ones. So far they've been able to stand back because a lot of flat stuff has been played at them. Now they have to, to change Late. the tactics a bit. Flatter smash and right shoulder. Seven, Son of A. Thomas. Yeah. Clever. Service over. Twelve. Seven. 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 I don't think I've seen him as animated as that ever before. Oh, that's good to see. Yeah. They're uh, just not getting any advantage, are they, with the drive defence? No. Serve. Nine didn't seem to hit through the shot. Yeah, just seemed to little tap at the shuttle. I was always taught you just sort of guided the shuttle over the net. Don't think of hitting the yes. shuttle in doubles when you're hitting a low serve. You just sort of Ten push seconds. it over. Mm. But it's so difficult. It is so difficult. Yeah, because of course your opponent is standing there. It, you're under so much pressure. Everyone thinks it's, oh, this is easy. How can they miss it? But I'm telling you, it is so difficult. Sometimes we're talking about millimeters. If it's wrong, you get it right between the eyes. Yeah. So it's over. 
That is over. 14-10. Especially intimidating for a woman in mixed in, doubles, in mixed doubles yes. serving to the man. Yeah, absolutely. He's so much bigger standing there. Yeah. And standing further f forward as well. Fifteen ten. Well, looks as if we could be heading towards a deciding game. I don't want to get ahead of myself, but it would be a fascinating scenario because the opening game is so one-sided in favour of the Germans, and in all honesty, I felt that the Indian pair growing in confidence and really beginning to find their four. Yes, come here. Well, that's the kiss of death, isn't it? When as soon as I send praises. <laughs> it always happens. Don't worry, Curse but I still think you're right. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't do that. The flat, fast exchanges. Yeah, he was. Yeah. Twelve, fifteen. He just couldn't help himself. It's so easy to say, oh, I've got an opportunity here, I, I go for it, but he just shouldn't do it. What should he have done? Just either block that straight or blocked it cross? Yeah, I would have blocked it cross and then just follow in. Yeah. That used to be one of my favourite shots, that cross court block. <laughs> Drift. A gap that can be easily closed. Hey. So it's over 3 points away from a third and deciding game. And if anyone is wondering, there's a match on, on the next call where England is just about to qualify for the second round of the men's doubles. And obviously being played in London, there's a lot of people here to follow the English pair. And incidentally, they were a wild card entry, but making the most of their opportunity, it appears. That's over, 40-19. Now or never, as far as the Germans are concerned, if they want to win this in two straight games. Well, as you probably guessed, <laughs> the English pair, Anthony Clark and Chris Langridge, on the adjoining court, have just secured victory over Hirobi and Kazuno of Japan. Soft to smash there from Ward. Yeah. Good choice. Don't give them anything to work with there. Okay. 
So now four game point opportunities for the Indian pair. Oh, a loose serve. Got what it deserved. Come and gone. The other two remain. Oh, At the era from Michael Fuchs, and it is indeed one Second game all. One by Rupert Thomas, another Thomas, 21-18. 21-18 confirms the umpire. Just 31 minutes for two games. Yeah, it's a quick match. Yeah. But what a transformation. Didn't look in it at all in that opening game. No, they gave it everything away and then suddenly they decided, OK, we're going to give it a fight. Somehow it just shows how wrong I was when I said, you know, this, I saw the match as the first set. You know, that's the picture I had in my head. But the engine pair really managed to, to to play a good second game, and, and that's obviously the standard they have. So I was wrong. Yeah. Well, I I questioned the Indian pair, their real inner desire and spirit, you know, because of course you can give everything, but if if it's not burning deep within, then it's sometimes difficult to produce, you know, the sort of performance that they've produced in the past. We know that Rupesh Kumar and Sanabe Thomas are very clever men's doubles pair achieved a lot i mean you don't go around winning seven career titles in men's doubles one of the very tough disciplines unless you're a very good pairing indeed Final game, Lavo, play. play. One last. Again, we saw the flick serve here and the flat answer they get. They can work with that. It's called good. Two last. Tend to be very committed to that backhand defence, doesn't he? Mm. Rupesh Kumar. Sorry, son of a Thomas. Yes. I was uh, starting questioning myself. Uh, no, 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 no. That was my mistake. <laughs> I apologise. Over, 
He's got nice skills from the front of the courts. Holds the shot for a long time, doesn't he? And then that little push at the last moment, yeah. opponents start coming forward. And it's well disguised. There's no doubt in my mind that the two Indian players have raised their game, but I also think there's been quite a dramatic sort of slump in the yeah. standard of play of Fuchs and Rott. And I don't really understand it because they look so confident and so eager in that opening yeah. game. And they need to really get the well, Three this is five. interesting because Fuchs really trying to urge himself on he and really get going again. Yeah, kicking himself a bit. Come on, get, you can do it. Okay. Uh, it's going out. Four or five. Kennen wir die Lösung, aber immer noch Geduld und Variation, nicht nur Druck, Druck, Druck. <laughs> Even I think I understood that. Sounds like Jakob Hoy. <laughs> <laughs> He's talking about variation. He wants more variation, not just attacking. He was lucky that uh, it was going out, but it hit the opponent. Time is over, 6-4. variation he wanted. Service over, five, six. Good men up. Yeah, he's pleased with that. <laughs> he also said variation just in German, which is somewhere between variation and Danish variation. <laughs> Service over, seven, five. Seven, five. Yeah. 
he's the one that's really making the difference now, Lyle. isn't he? He's, he's taking the opportunity to come forward and he's mm. commanding the net position. And he's able to put them away. Yeah. And once again, it was that time on the backhand side, but the little hold and suddenly push at the last moment. Very deceptive, very difficult to read. Service over, 6-9. Service over, 10, 6. Yeah, that's disappointing. Come on. Yes. Yeah, finds the gap. And they have the advantage, five-point advantage to be precise. 11, 6 interval. Change and ends. the mid-game interval. Players change ends, of course, in the deciding game. Now, you've been urging them to do <laughs> that for some time, Morton. That was gap. That's what I wanted. It just proves the point anyway. Yeah. So it's over. 7-12. here from the Germans. Yeah. Nine, twelve. Three straight points, but my goodness, hasn't it put a different complexion on this deciding it has. game? It's all, uh, it's all on the serve at the moment. Yeah. Another good one. Both pairs sensing how important that was. Not the best of serves. No, nope, but they got out of it. Gone away with that as well. 49. The error from Rot. As he Can't tried be. to intercept. Oh, far too flat. 
Yeah, but you see, you can see on the slow motion that he wrote his assist too much based in the center of the court. So he's not really moving to the side for the straight smash coming down. So he can intercept. So he's got to move and hit at the same time. And he's too much under pressure and makes a mistake. Again, uh, uh, we emphasize how important it is for, for the smashes not only to be a hard smash, but also a steep smash. And here again, Fuchs is winning his uh, steep smash. He doesn't hit very hard, but the fact that it's steep is enough to win. No! 11-14. Yes, all of a sudden, the serve and looking, hunting for that third shot. Only he's making a big difference. Just took all the Sanzo pace out of the interception 15, shot there. And got it very early. Yeah. Up. Yeah, just guiding it in a downward direction. Quick oh. no. serve, too long. Over, oh my goodness, oh. round the back shots from Son of A. Thomas, but to no avail. Always a crowd pleaser, but rarely does it gain much advantage. <laughs> well, only chance he had. He was completely caught. Yeah. yeah. He's the one that's really made the difference, isn't he? Soft shot again. And then going for it. It's a good smash. So it's over. Fourteen sixteen. It's when they're guiding the shuttle into the open space. It all looks so easy. Yes. It's Kumar who's uh, turned this uh, rally around. Uh, we couldn't see it here in the slow motion, but uh, at a particular point in the rally, he, he slowed it down, played a soft shot and moved in. And from there, the Indian pair was in control.
service over. Please clean 18. Well, how desperately the Germans need a little run on serve right now. is brilliant play from that the over, Indian pair, using all their experience. Still fighting, that's Seven good to see. 60, they always do. Yeah. Just two points in it now. And look at the reaction of the Germans. Delight at seeing the shuffle go into the net. And the point is theirs. Oh, an error oh, yeah, on yeah, the yeah. flick serve. What As a time to do it. <laughs> Well, that's all that. 20 match points. Seven. Match points now, three of them. For such an experienced player to do that. Well, he'll be kicking himself for that. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. And all credit to Rupesh Kumar and Sanabe Thomas of India because they were completely outclassed in the opening game, but they came back from that game deficit and in the end found match some terrific form. They struggled at the start of the match. 18, 21, so three games needed for the victory and a big smile from Kulela Dolpichand. 9-21, 21-18. Twenty-one seventeen in the deciding game in a match. Eight minutes shy of the hour mark.